Bridget Bishop will get what she deserves. But for Giles Corey, his punishment was peine forte dure. Doesn't that sound romantic? Pen forte dure. It means hard and forceful punishment. Or more poetically, death by pressing. Since Giles Corey refused to speak the truth, it was decided that the truth should be pressed from him. First, they had to strip him naked. And perhaps it's best if I show you like this. First, a long board was placed on the ground like so. Then Giles Corey was forced to strip naked and forced to lay down upon that board. Another sturdy board was placed across his chest. Then they began to place large rocks on, his, on the board so that the weight would begin to press him into the ground. When asked to confess, Giles Corey said, More weight! <laughs> Those were his only words. So they added more rocks and more weight. Again, when asked to confess, Giles Corey said, More weight! <laughs> this went on for three days. With more rocks being added and more weight, began to crush his chest and his eyes began to bulge out of their sockets. At one point, his purple tongue stuck out and the constable had to poke it back in again with his cane. <laughs> Finally, Giles Corey was no more. And they say that Giles Corey was a dreadful wizard, but I think he was the most delightful witch of all. <laughs> the Sandwich.